Somebody, please wake me up. Please wake me up. There's no way this can be happening. What's really going on? Society is really devolving, man. And it's barely holding on. I can't believe that this is happening in 2024. Are schools that's hiring anybody? Like, like, I mean, that's anybody. Because, guys, pay close attention to this entire video. Because this individual probably was teaching your kids. Yeah, that's right. I was very disappointed. I, I just, like, I know about the wokeness. I know about all of that type of stuff. But when you see this happening in school, and schools are hiring these type of individuals, they're supposed to be getting our kids ready for the future when they can't even get themselves ready. They are lost. The blind leading the blind. This is exactly what this is. Hey, man, if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you like, share, subscribe. Leave a comment in the comment section. And let me know what you guys think about this video here in the comments. With that said, let's get into this one. Ow! 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 Put ow, your feet in there. Ow! Put your ow, feet in there. Ow, there. <laughs> On February 7th, 2024 in Ohio, police were called about a woman causing a disturbance. I called him. Hi. Hello. We just talked last night. What's going yeah. on today? Um, they put me out because I got robbed. Okay. They kicked me out of the building and I want my things back and they won't let me go get my things. Okay. Do you have ID on you? No. Okay. They melted in the last house fire that I had. Okay. What's your name? I don't really want to do this. I'm really just trying to leave. Okay. I'm I, trying to be here. I need I your information. I don't want to talk to you. Okay, if you don't talk, you're going to sit in the cruiser. What do I have to sit in the cruiser See? for? I'm not even on their property. Okay. I'm on the okay. We're not going to have, we're not going to do this. Either you're going to give me your information, or you're going to have a seat in my cruiser until I identify you. Am I clear? I don't see why. Okay. I'm, get off of me. Nope. Daddy, he's grabbing me. Come on. Uh uh, uh uh. Okay? You don't put your hands on me. You don't touch me. Okay? I didn't do nothing. I asked you to. Like I asked you to identify. Put the phone down. Stop. Get off of me. Stop. Well, get off of me. You're hurting me. Simple instruction. I'm here. You're hurting me. Take it off. Take it off. You're hurting me. Okay, we're not trying to You're hurt you. Get off of me. Okay. He is grabbing me maliciously. He is trying to hurt me. Malicious. You are about to dislocate my shoulder. Then stop pulling away, okay? Because you're hurting me. Okay, stop pulling away. What the f? I got robbed yesterday and y'all are arresting me? Okay. Real shit? <laughs> <laughs> These guys. I know you're being detained, but you're about For to. For what? Detained. Okay. This is I not didn't how, do this, anything! Man, this isn't how you behave, okay? This isn't how I behave! All I'm asking is why I'm being asked questions like I'm the person that. doing anything wrong! <laughs> man, that's not how you behave! <laughs> Sir, I know, I know, I know exactly how you feel, man. Ma'am, it's a simple, ain't no identification, you know, this is very simple. She said she lost her ID in her last apartment, in the fire. So. Nothing, it didn't cross your mind that you have to get a new one. Okay. Dude, Come my on. phone, my phone. All right, we'll grab my phone. it. She's a pain. So, what happened? <laughs> she, I don't know, she was pulling away from him or something. She's trying, she refusing to identify. I don't know. I mean, okay, but, we so. can come okay. okay. Um, so, long story, so she called a you guys again today i thought i saw a call on the board about that i, yeah. I didn't take it but so, it looked familiar um and then it came up that her credit card was stolen and airpods and money and just just and she made a report oh, and mm -hmm. uh got statements from everyone but during that she like verbally attacked me threats towards our staff person but also um some transphobic um comments made directly to one of our youth um, that we have a zero tolerance for. Bro, this is crazy. She said transphobic. I can't stand when they use that word. Ugh. They use the word for people that have no problem with trans. I, <laughs> that because you don't agree with them, they'll call you transphobic. Lady, this is another video for the subject. I'm going to be quiet and I'm going to keep my comments to myself.
I'm tired of this wokeness. I'm tired of it. Dad, I can't wait to talk to the commissioner about you. Okay. But you... Look, this is crazy. I asked you to identify I know. I wasn't even identify. on Daybreak property. I was on the sidewalk, dude. You're I wasn't even on Daybreak. How? I was on the phone outside not talking to nobody but my phone. Okay. They want you trespassed. They want me trespassed because I want my things out of my apartment because they're kicking me out. She's talking to her phone. I just wanted to go get my things. All you had to do was identify yourself. I was on the sidewalk. I wasn't even on their property. How am I being trespassed? Best. Sit down. Please explain to me how I'm being- Sit down now! Please explain to me- <laughs> Will you listen to me, Parker? Shut up! <laughs> You're gonna go to jail. For? For? Resisting at this point. Resisting what? I'm Sit just down. asking you questions. You can't answer the questions I'm asking you. when you're in the car. Why couldn't you answer them on the sidewalk when I was asking you because peacefully? Because I asked you to identify yourself. And I asked you why Sit if I'm not on their property. Sit down. I'm asking you peacefully. I don't want to make you get in the car. If you make me get in the car and you harm me, I swear to God, I'm suing. That's fine, you can sue. Oh, I'm suing y'all. Oh, I'm hurt. Oh, my neck, my back. Dude, I'm just Sit asking down. you why. <laughs> That's all they do. Man, guys, you know what you're looking at right now? You're looking at a professional, yes. Not just a teacher, a professional victim. This is what we're looking at. You heard me? I sue you. These are who they have. These are the type of individuals they have teaching the youth the future. What is, what is she teaching? I would really love to know. If one of you guys could fill me in in the comments, I would love to know what she teaches. I'm being trespassed. I am literally just asking you why. All I was trying to do was get my things out of my apartment. That. You were causing a disturbance inside. How was I causing a disturbance? I wasn't even Sit inside. Down. They asked me to step outside and I stepped Sit outside. Down. What are you talking about? Sit down. When, I, when you got here, I was outside by myself. Sit down. I'm confused. You can't just explain to me what's going on. Until you sit down. You literally can't just explain to me nope. what's going on. I've already I'm not even resisting at this moment. Want to be difficult. I'm not trying to be difficult. I really don't difficult. understand. Just because you perceive it as difficulty doesn't mean I am intentionally trying not to be difficult. Refusing to get in the car is arrestable. I don't understand what Do I am being handcuffed for. Do you want to go to jail? I don't understand why I'm being handcuffed. I don't understand why you guys are here. I've I just wanted someone. explained all of that. I just asked for them to get my clothes. I've explained why you're being detained. Do you understand the words that are coming out of my mouth? No, you didn't. Are you going to sit down? So you're not going to look at the so tape and see what disturbance I caused? I, I can't do anything door. until you get in the car. <laughs> sit down, please. Are you going to sit down or are we going to go to jail? What am I going to jail for? What am I literally going to jail Disorderly for? conduct. I just, want my, I just want my clothes because I'm about to be homeless and again. And we can, we can work that out, but we're not going to work anything out with you with you refusing to get in the I car. was literally calling my ride Sit to down. leave. I wasn't even trying to stay here. Sit down. You are handcuffing me and I was calling my ride to leave. Sit down. Dude, this is crazy. Sit down. No. Sit down. No, I'm not going to jail, dude. No. I don't want to take you to jail. Did I've, you just I, cut your cam off? I have no desire to take you to care. Then why don't you just talk to me like a civilized person? I wasn't uncivil with you last night. Why are you being uncivil with me today? Oh, no. Why are you being uncivilized with this young lady, sir? Why are you yelling at her and disrespecting her? Why are you screaming in her ass? She can hear you. Calm down, sir. Man, these people make me sick, man. Cut it out, lady. Damn, it's like being in class and telling one of the kids, Sit down. Uh-uh. Class about to start. Can you imagine one of the kids did this? I don't understand what you mean. What do you mean? What are you talking about? Explain to me again. I don't know. No, I don't understand what you mean. Can you imagine one of the kids did that? That's what I mean. What is she teaching? We you just... identify yourself, ma'am. Dude, I was not even on their property. I was on the curb waiting for a lift. Are you going to get in? I'm literally waiting on my okay. lift. So I we, don't see we, why we, I need we, to be identified if I'm leaving we, the premises. We want to go to jail. I don't understand. Okay. No, I'm, I'm, I'm talking you, to you. you Why you can't you just answer? You understand plenty because I've already explained it. No, I'm Several not times. understanding. I'm telling you that I was on the curb waiting for my lift. I'm not even on their property because the sidewalk is not daybreak property. Sit down. And you came to trespass me on property that I wasn't even on. It doesn't Please matter. Please explain to me. It doesn't matter. How does it not matter? They want you trespassed. How does I that not matter? You. I understand that. You have that. to identify yourself. But to be trespassed, you have to actually be on the premises. Not how I was it works. not on the premises. It's not how it works. I wasn't on the premises. Sit down. I wasn't on the premises. Sit down. I only, and I'm the one that called y'all. I had them call y'all so y'all could escort me to get my things so that it wouldn't You're be a not problem. You're the only one that called if you called. I'm Sit the down. reason why they called. I asked I'm them to sure. call. What's the number to 911? 
you're the reason why we got why why we got called. I don't like the tone that you're talking to me I, with. Like I'm a problem matter. or something, dude. It doesn't matter. You are definitely a problem since I got here. How am I a problem? I was simply that. asking you questions and you tried to dislocate my shoulder. Sit down. No, dude. And now you're trying to do it again. No, now you want to press the button and like you're being civil with me and you're not being civil with what me. What button? Whatever button you got your finger on. Oh, nobody's pressed the button. Well, please <laughs> let me go. I've asked you many times to get in the car, and, and I don't you just understand why I have to, to get in the car. If you're not taking me to jail, why am I getting in the car? At this point, you're probably going to go to jail. For what? Disorderly conduct. Disorderly conduct. Resisting how? arrest. Resisting arrest of what? I've already explained all I this. I haven't committed a crime. Mankind became stupider at a frightening rate. The population exploded, and intelligence continued to decline. Definitely committed a crime. What was the crime I committed? I've just said that. Resisting arrest. Arrest of what? What Disorderly am I being arrested conduct. for? Disorderly conduct Failure how? Identify. Failure to identify when I wasn't on the premises and I was about to leave. It doesn't matter. I don't see how that doesn't matter. That matters quite I'm, a bit. I'm trying to help you out. No, you're not. You're not explaining anything to I've me in a calm manner. I've many things, many times. No, you haven't. Mm -hmm. You're not actually explaining anything. Are you going to identify yourself? Can you take these cuffs off of me, dude? No. Then what am I identifying myself for? If you can't compromise with me, what am I compromising so with you for? So you can be trespassed. So that I can be trespassed. I don't even care about being trespassed. I just want my Obviously. clothes. I just want my clothes. Can y'all go get my clothes? I'll comply if I can have my things. What's that? Yeah, I, I, I know. It's literally we, we just me trespassing. To all, I all was that. leaving. I have yeah. somewhere to be at 6 o'clock. I was leaving. My lift is on the way. I wasn't about to be here. Are you going to identify yourself or are you going to jail? Oh, my goodness, lady. How many times guys have to cop had to say, man, you're only being detained because you won't identify yourself. We are not, and I repeat, we are not going to arrest you you're only being a team because you want to identify yourself if you identify yourself you can trespass you and all this could be done this is it guys that's all she has to do simplest instruction and she's supposed to be some type of teacher simple that's all she gotta do cop could go do what he gotta do and this could be done can i do it with him no I can't do it with I'm him. I'm standing right here. I understand you're standing right here. If I but get my notepad out, will you give me your name? And yes. Okay, let me if he can get his hand off of me, because that's unnecessary. I understand y'all got to do the good cop, bad cop, but like there this is unnecessary. Good cop, bad cop. Good cop, bad cop. You choose that cop. <laughs> No, it, def it definitely is, and he's the one trying to put so me there. So, so what's your name, ma'am? Can you let go of me? No, just, no. What's your name? Can he let go of me? Just, what's your name? Can he listen, let go listen, of me? I'm telling you. He's hurting my arm. Can he let go of me? He's not hurting your arm. He is hurting my arm. I'm telling you, you right now, we're not, we're not giving many more warnings. Here's the thing. You are either going to give me your name and your birthday, as required by law, or you're going to jail. Jail Don't. for what? It can't be bargained with. It can't be reasoned with. It doesn't feel pity. For failing to identify. <coughs> that's a, a, that's yes. illegal? Yes. How? Okay. You want to, you know what, we're not going to, we've been through this. No, we haven't. Want, you haven't times. explained to me how it's illegal to not tell you my name. So if I wasn't on the premises that I'm supposed to be being trespassed you're from. Being, you're being I don't understand. I understand that. I understand I'm Are being Are you going to give me your name, yes or no? Yes or no? I no, just I'm, want I'm to have an understanding of what's going on before I do. Once I put my notepad away, then, it, then, it's, then you're just going to jail. So you guys really aren't going to give me an understanding of what's going on here. We were I am, trespassed. I understand trespassed. I'm being trespassed. Okay. I get that. So I need your name to trespass you. I understand that. My because issue is... Right now is, you don't go to jail over being trespassed. I just have a messed up shoulder and a bruised up arm. From what? From him! Are, are, you, are you alleging that there was force used against yes. you? Yes! Okay. Well, sit down. We, we got to call Sergeant now. Okay. Call him. Sit down. Sit down. Oh, heck no. Or you're going to be put in the car. Check, okay? And I will pop document more force. Sit down. Wow. Get your feet in. I'm sitting down. No, nope. put your feet in there. That's all you all requested. Was put your feet down. in now. Now I'm requesting you to put your feet in. Wow. Ow! 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 Put your feet in there. Ow! Put your feet in there. There. That's right. Man, handle her. Enough, man. How many times they got to explain it? They spin it fast, slow, and then slower. And then he broke it down by the word. He even had to spell it out for you, ma'am. How many times, how many different ways they got to explain this? Get your behind in the car. <laughs> God, man. Where does people come from? Wow. Burn it down, God, burn it down. Contend with those, contend with me. What you God got to do with this? Mine, take it. Okay. Wow. 
Okay. My arms hurt. My ribs hurt. My hip is bruised. Damn, all of that? I don't ever do nothing to nobody. She falling apart? I'm not my business. I'm quiet. I'm respectful. Cocaine is a hell of a drug. <laughs> I mean, I say things people like, but I say what needs to be said. And now because of it, I'm in the back of a police car. All of this because I wanted my clothes because I was told I was homeless after getting off work. Even their ride along God ruin her life from this moment on let everything she touched fall apart god let everything he loves he lose god let his wife let his children be you crazy man you sound insane do you realize that i know this loser is not are you, you guys paying attention this lady is insane she needs to be reevaluated right now guys she is really Praying for other people's downfall. Is that what you pray to God for? Man, you just told us your life is in shambles. Shouldn't you be praying to God to help you in life and through your situation? You praying, you wasting your quality and precious time and air to pray for other people's downfall. No wonder why your life is the way it is. Case closed, guys. This explains this individual. Who prays to God for other people's downfall in life? I have never seen something like that. God don't want to get involved in this. Man, you seems like you're not a nice person. No, you're not. Something's wrong with you. God, let his cars break down. Let his job short his pay. Let his taxes take all his money. Let Bailey do on spot, God. Let her be like Lot's wife. When she looks back at me, let her be struck with ailments. Right. Do not speak to me. I do not want to talk to you. I want to talk to the sergeant. Do not speak to me. 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 Do not speak to me with your little self. You need to feel empowered. Do not speak to me. 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 Hi, I'm Sergeant Staples with Dayton Police. You asked to speak with me? Yes, sir. Okay, what's going on? Um, that officer 281 tried to dislocate my shoulder and they yanked me across the back of this thing. He hit my hip and my rib cage on this here. Okay. And he's bruised my arm. Okay. Oh, my and all I wanted to know was why I was being trespassed when I was the one that requested y'all to come. I asked them to have the security guard call y'all so y'all could escort me upstairs to get my things because they think I'm a danger to the building. That's the only reason y'all are here. I was trying to handle things the proper way. Okay. So when they asked you to leave, did you walk out? Or? Yes, I told them to call y'all so that they could take me upstairs to get my things. Okay. I had a ride on the way. I was on the phone with my father so he could come collect me and my things. And that's when he yanked me up. Okay. Did he ask you to leave before he ain't you? No, I told him I could leave without getting my things. Okay. Okay. How long are you going to stay in here at daybreak? <laughs> Lie. Two months. Two months? Okay. My house burned down. Okay. All right. Um. Liar. You know she didn't you notice, guys? She didn't mention anything about him saying, ma'am, the ones you trespass. I didn't hear that once come out of her mouth. I can lie, man. Ma'am, you just you told you telling them that your house burned down, but you praying now for other people's downfall and lying, and you wonder why some people really are their own worst enemy. She refused to look at herself in the mirror. Just refuse, ma'am. You're the reason why your life is the way it is. You a nasty person. Can't trust you at all. How they have you around teaching. And the only reason why I can't go back inside is because their person robbed me last night. I met Officer 281 last night. He was here when I got robbed. Okay. The only That's the only reason why I'm being put out because I, I told dude that he needs to give me my stuff back or it won't be good for him. And they considered that a threat. Okay. 
And the threat was you, me calling the police. That was the threat I meant. I wasn't going to do nothing to that man. I'm a whole school teacher. Okay. I wouldn't harm nobody. Oh, school. A school no, I'm a school teacher oh, of special yeah. ed children. I wouldn't harm nobody intentionally. I wouldn't do nothing to mess up my future. But your police officers had me in the back of the car in handcuffs for no reason. I wouldn't have. Uh, I wouldn't have been against giving my name. I just wanted to know why I was giving my name to be trespassed. <laughs> <laughs> If I wasn't even on their property, I was by the curb. I was waiting on the curb for my father because I know I can't be on property if I'm being trespassed. But again, when an officer is a <laughs> lawful order, it doesn't matter if you agree with said lawful order or not. You still have to provide that, okay? Because he was here doing an investigation, okay? And All he had to do was tell me because they were questioning. If he would have told me what... You guys listen carefully and paid attention. What did she just say? Let me see if you guys get it. She just told the cop that she knew that she was being trespassed. I'll rest my case. Before I would have complied, I have no... My dad is a whole sheriff. I don't have nothing against police officers. Okay. I just wanted to know what was going on. Okay. I got anxiety. Stuff like that is important to me. I just wanted oh to know what was going God. on. Okay. That's All victim. Right, for me, okay? My whole life was a victim. Right, we're just going to switch cars over here, okay? This cop's talking so nice, it's crazy. Whoa! Don't want to do it. Just, we're, we're all gonna be here. Come on, this, Sergeant Staples, can you be the one to do it? Listen, you wanted me. <laughs> and you held my legs as he dragged me across the backseat of this car. Using to get in the car so. I sat down. I was gonna turn myself, and you didn't have to have him drag me across the car. You could have just turned what? my legs for oh me. Oh my! Sergeant Fire! Staples, can you please move him? He's making my anxiety bad. I can't. <laughs> here, can we? Can we step out, please? <laughs> Did you raise your voice at me? Get out of the damn car! <laughs> this is sad, no oh, man, no. Oh. Pathetic. You're a despicable you man. Right here, okay. We're just gonna walk right. Uh, back, back there. Back there. No. Nah. Yes, Hope they're fine. You're taken into custody and charged with criminal trespassing and resisting arrest. Do you think the woman should have complied with the officer's lawful orders to avoid this situation? So you guys heard all the old mouth, wow, that she's a special ass teacher. Children that need, you know, special attention, help. Yes! Guys, I need to know. Those type of classes, right? And those type of um, programs, what does it require? Yes, a whole lot of patience. Yes, and a whole lot of understanding. Communication. Where did she communicate this entire video? Simple instruction. Simple. And it was a victim. Yes, she's teaching special education. Yes, yes, that's her. That same lady you just saw. This is really sad. You know what's even sadder? I can't put it on YouTube. But I can't really talk about it too much. But I just want to try to... You know, put it in a way you guys can see where I'm coming from. There was a video. Maybe you guys go look it up. There was a special needs kid. I, I no, I believe no. He was an autistic kid on a bus. And you know they have those people that call, that helps with the kids on the bus and stuff like that. She, guys, she was caught on camera. She was doing the unthinkable to that teenage kid. Yep, autistic. And the unthinkable I'm talking about is not a nice one. And I'm not talking about yelling or screaming at the kid. I'm talking about hands-on. Yes, guys. That's what I just said. It takes patience. Especially with autistic, autistic kids and stuff like that. It takes a lot of patience. It could be very stressful. People like that shouldn't be teaching in schools. Lady can't understand simple instructions. Simple. No matter how many times the cop explains it. She even slipped out her mouth and said, yes, I know I'm being trespassed. Ma'am, if you know you're being trespassed, you know what you're supposed to do when you're getting trespassed. Come on, man. And I'm, seeing, I'm starting to see a lot of this, a lot of teachers. I have so many times I see on the news, teachers, they in the students, married teachers, cheating with the students. I'm seeing, the, I'm seeing things that I have never, ever seen in my 30-something years. Never. You don't tell me something's wrong with society. It's happening very often. Way too often. Like every other week you're hearing something about teachers messing with students. I remember when teachers used to talk to you like a parent. 
get you ready for get you ready for the real world. I remember my teacher used to tell us about jail and how it could ruin your life. Those are the type of teachers we used to have. Who used to look at the who we used to respect. No teachers act like they're best friends with you. Like, hey, you want to go hang out after school? You know what I mean? You want to go? You want to go get a couple drinks? That's how they act now. That's why you see teachers going to the certain level of dating students that they're teaching. And I'm talking about in high school and middle school. I'm not even talking college. Man, something's really wrong, man. Nah. Wow. This is why I said this woke nonsense got to go, man. It's doing something mentally to society. We're seeing things that we would never see. Maybe, maybe it used to happen, but not at the rate it's happening right now. No, no, no. Even people come in and said, Mom, how come we never had teachers like that when we was in high school and middle school? I rest my case. This lady was her own worst enemy, and you guys heard it for yourself. She was sitting in behind that police car, praying for other people's downfall in life. Meanwhile, she wouldn't even look in the mirror and see that her own life is a mess. Well, what does that tell you about her? That she refused to acknowledge that she's her own worst enemy. Hey man, if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you like, share, subscribe. Leave a comment in the comment section. And let me know what you guys think about this video here in the comments. And until then, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out. You guys have a blessed day.